Hello, in this video, I'm going to be talking about why I support James Charles. So let's get into it. For starters, when he started getting big and all that, like, he he's a real inspiration because guys with makeup always got, like, judged and stuff. You know what I mean? <clears throat> so, to see that he got as big as he did, he's honestly an inspiration. I get it. He let the fame get to his head. But does the world have to hate on James Charles forever? Like, come on. I get it. He let it get to his head and he betrayed the person who cared about him the most. I mean, I get that that's not right, but does the world really have to hate him for it? I mean, I've made mistakes. I've said things I shouldn't have said. I did things I shouldn't have done. So has he. But I feel like he just went power hog with his fame with the thing that the straight men thing. I think he just let the fame get to his head and think he could the fame and the fortune get to his head and think he could just buy anyone out i think that's what that actually sounds like it doesn't sound like a predator it sounds like he let the fame get to his head you know what i mean don't act like he's the only celebrity that let the fame get to his head please do not do that please please and honestly to see that he that i think he was like i don't know how long he was out gay for, like how long long the world knew he, that he was gay but based on everyone doubted him in the beginning and he he succeeded you know what I mean there was a lot of people that doubted him but he did it like Tati mentioned on her YouTube channel like she was saying about how people that doubted him and all that so like honestly I, I don't I, I haven't really known of Tati I don't dislike her and I don't really like her because I don't really know her but I've heard of James Charles way before I heard of Tati. I only discovered Tati because of the stuff that was going on with James Charles. Like, that James Charles palette was around Christmas time. That was everywhere. Like, that was everywhere on TikTok. Like, the video of Lauren God Godwin, like, like, using something to break the palettes thing, basically. Like, the, the colors inside. And I guess she made a good TikTok that proved a good point. She said, now that's cool that she did that. Like, but months ago, everyone was hating her for it. Honestly, I kind of went with the meme of how people thought that, like, I went on TikTok and I, like, acted, like, shocked or something. I forget what I did in the duet, but it was based on the point of the meme. But now everyone would probably be like, yeah, she's, she did that. She did that. You know what I mean? But honestly, I still think people should appreciate James Charles' makeup for what it really is. You know what I mean? Just aside the memes, I hope he gained some subscribers back eventually. I get it. He should have not tried to make straight men gay with bribes of money and manipulation and blackmailing, but I do not agree with those actions at all, and I think those are very bad actions of his. <clears throat> I really do. I'm not saying he should do that, but I'm just saying he's a very talented guy. He re He's really good with makeup stuff. <clears throat> so I'm just saying everybody makes mistakes, and... <laughs> I get why Tati doesn't forgive him, and she shouldn't have to because she she took him in, and he basically betrayed her. So I'm not justifying that. I'm not saying Tati should forgive him, but I'm saying this is why I support him because he 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 didn't let any of the hate get to him that he got for being gay or for being a man who likes makeup. Because a lot of men these days get shamed that they like makeup or nail polish or anything like that. So. Especially years ago when he first started, especially then, like. So I'm just saying, like, that's a, I, I really respect him for following his dreams, you know what I mean? And I don't agree with that whole trying to make the straight men gay thing. I absolutely do not agree with that. I do not mind the LGBT community, and I support it, but I do not appreciate him, just like a lot of other people, do not appreciate him trying to make straight men gay. That That's the one thing that I didn't really like, but. Besides that, it just seemed like he, and including that actually, actually I think that came when the fame came because he thought he could overpower people because he was famous probably. It seemed like he basically just let the fame get to his head and I think everyone deserves a second chance and I think he does too, so. Please give a thumbs up, please comment down below what you thought, share the video, spread the video, subscribe and hit the notification bell for more videos. Thank you for watching.